few years ago, I needed to get back home for Christmas uh, to get to my home place, uh, which is in Vendée, for those of you who know where this remote place in France is. It's about 300 miles from Paris. And actually, all the trains were full, and um, I found myself in a situation where I could not actually uh, meet my family for Christmas. And so in the end, my little sister came and picked me up uh, in Paris, and then she brought me back to Vendée. Uh, and on the road, I remarked that almost all the cars were empty, and I was like, wow, that was tons of seats actually available, but they were not in the trains, they were in the cars, because all the cars on the road, almost all of them were empty. And so I was like, okay, we need to index all this in a search engine, a search engine or something. And so that's how the idea came about. Um, and actually for 72 hours, I didn't sleep. Yeah, well, I tried to go sleep and then I was like, this is too simple of an idea, it must exist. And I was coming back and like looking for it in all languages I knew and then it did not exist to the, the scale uh, I wished. So that's how the, uh, the, the story of Blah Blah Car began. Um, and so just to make clear what we do today, it's ride sharing, so we allow drivers with empty seats to actually share them with passengers going the same way. And as you can see from these slides, um, when you drive alone, not only everything is gray around you and you're bored and you pay a lot of money, uh, but then when you are sharing your car, it's all joyful, colorful, and it costs you less money. Well, that's, that's basic marketing, but I'm sure you will remember that next time you'll be alone uh, behind the wheel. Um, and you could enjoy a nice ride with passengers and uh, feeling that the, the, actually the journey is shorter because you've been sharing part of your life with, uh, with people. So what we exactly are is a combination of a search engine, a travel search engine, and a community. Uh, we are providing a service for transporting people that actually is on a community uh, which shares values. And um, if we look at the growth of uh, what we've witnessed over the past years, so I began almost 10 years ago. Uh, this is a growth since 2009. I spared you like the years from 2004 to 2009, which as you can guess are about the sickness of the line. Um, and this was actually the time where uh, we were figuring out the product market fit. So the way we would offer a service uh, that would fit our community, and so I would spend like hours during the weekends calling all the members and making sure that we were actually providing a service that uh, would fit their needs. And then uh, over the past years, we've, it seems we've found the recipe for growth, uh, and now we have a community of 20 million members. 